That's Mr. Anoop Maheshwari joining in to talk about um, the event, the markets and a lot more. Mr. Maheshwari, thank you very much for joining in this evening. Can you now tell us first about what you think about the event, the initiative which is undertaken in terms of letting retail investors know more and possibly get more involved in the market? Sure, no, I think it's a great initiative taken by Reliance Mutual Fund. It's nice for them to have gone through all the effort of getting it all together for everyone. And of course by CNBC for getting giving it the coverage that it has. So, very nice initiative and uh, yeah, it's always good to connect with investors, try and speak your heart to them and hear from them more importantly, which we do normally, but uh, this is a nice platform as well. Okay. Um, you know, there there's opinion from Rhythm that just came in saying that um, DIIs are going to far surpass FIIs eventually. Do you believe that's going to happen and by when? So we have the potential, uh, for sure. Uh, in terms of uh, you know what time frame and whether it'll be consistent is a different matter altogether because flows also go pretty much hand in hand with the way markets perform. Uh, but there's no question about the fact that uh, there's a lot, a lot of scope for ownership domestically to increase. And from our point of view, that's a great thing. And uh, for investors also, I think equities particularly uh, will offer some very interesting returns. Well, uh, Ekta, I just want to butt in on uh, this yeah. one. Anup, I have been tracking you very, very closely for the last few years. Not just uh, the market talk, but I believe that uh, you like shooting as uh, as well. How big a passion is that? And does that help you uh, in, in what you do on a day-to-day -day basis? Yeah, it's it's not as bad as it sounds, actually. But, uh, no, it's an interesting sort of, you know, in our business, it's nice to pick up new hobbies once in a while. Mm -hmm. And if nothing else, a lot of these actually help you uh, become a better investor in a very indirect way. Uh, so I took up shooting mainly for my child, actually, because it improves concentration. And uh, so I took it up as well, and uh, it actually helps in concentration. So in this very noisy world, I think it helps to be just a little more focused. And would it be an alternate uh, profession if given a chance? No, I'm not sure. I think this is my I've heard some good feedback. That's why I'm asking. No, no, no. The, investing is uh, the place I'd love to be. Yeah. I, I think I have a better uh, alternative to uh, shooting. Uh, Mr. Maheshwari loves aviation, so he has a deep interest in anything that flies. Uh, yeah, sort of. Uh, so, yeah, in, I'm very interested in aviation as a sector, not from an investment standpoint, but more just uh, looking at it. It comes from my, my dad used to be a pilot, so uh, there's an interest that uh, started at a very young age because of that. Yeah. Do you have a license? Are you trying for a license? Uh, no, not. I mean, I, I've uh, sat in planes quite a few times, but no, I don't fly regularly. No. Yeah, so you have a simulator at home. Is that how it no, works? No, nothing like that. I just uh, watch videos, and nowadays you can just access anything on the net anyway. So. And do you like the aviation sector as much, or you can't talk about it? Well, the sector is uh, a lot more challenging to invest into. Uh, I think, you know, again, uh, there's a lot of scope again in the sector, but I think we need to get to a point where the economics look a little more sustainable. So there will be periods where aviation might be worth investing into, but uh, over longer periods of time, it's been a difficult sector to be part of. Yeah. So which are the sectors you're liking? Oh, lots of them. Uh, you know, pharma is one great long-term sector generally that has created a lot of wealth for shareholders. So we like the economics of that business. Uh, financial services, uh, you know, our business is a part of that whole segment. We can see the potential there. So those are interesting areas. The whole, so there's so many consumption related sectors that have a lot of scope to grow. So multiple areas that are available for investors. All right, Mr. Maheshwari, thank you very much. Well, now it's over to Nigel.